Hello, welcome to Scrap Time episode 1067. My name is Christine and on today's episode, I'm showing you the Insight to Color Passions book. Today I am showing you the book Insight to Color Passions. It is edited by Tanya Jenny for North Light Books. And I just wanted to show you some things in here that might inspire you. So this is a series they do, and this one's all about color. And it's divided into emotion, composition, memory, process, message, and story. But of course, I'm sorry, I didn't read it all. I'm looking at all the pretty pictures like this one here. And when you look at this, there are so many creative things in it that will inspire you for your own art journal pages, be it the background, the flowers, the texture. And so I just loved all the projects in this book and I just got so much inspiration from it. And that's why I wanted to share it with you. Put some little bookmarks on some pages. So this page here with the background and the little pieces of paper really inspired me. And I made a page similar to this that I will be showing you after. Um, I liked the colors and then the ideas because I have so many collage papers that I thought, oh wow, I can cut up little squares of my collage papers and add them onto my page just like that. Then this page here, how the elements are collaged together and all the texture again, I, I thought of so many things I can take from this. These, both of these are just beautiful again with the color and the textures and just everything about it that you can just sit there and you can look at these pictures for so long and just feel like, okay, I need to go and create. At least that's how I get feel from looking at them. There's so much to take in. Both of these are similar to the other ones, but just the lightness of this and then how the color blends into the lightness. Cause I find I use so much color that I don't use a lot of white. And so looking at this, I'm like thinking of ways, maybe adding in a bit of white and then just, just the way there's like the scribble there and the colors blending into one another or this one, the explosion of color I thought is just beautiful. This one too with the white and the orange and blues, all the colors are on the page yet they work so well together um, beside one another. And then there's like collage elements and texture and ribbons or whatever else little add-ons here. This one here with the strips again with um, collage papers you have. You can add strips with painting and then paint over top and do random things on it and then put paper that way or tape, washi tape even could go over your strips and so much, so many ideas. And then I've got this one here again with the, I love those oranges and then up top with the greens and the simple little flowers. It's just beautiful. And I have one more to show you. Oh, I think it's this one because of course with the pinks, I love pinks and greens and then the texture underneath it, the solid and then the doodling. I just loved this page. So those are just a few of the pages from this book. So there's so many in here that you're guaranteed to be inspired by this book. And so I'll go back to that first page I mentioned and I'll bring mine in and so you should definitely in lots of ways see how I was inspired by it for one the colors I chose the greens and the bit of white and blues and that for my background and then I did the squares and I did some sprinkle or splatters on it so I sort of duplicated it in my own way but it's not bad to duplicate things. It's a way to learn. That's how I look at it. By duplicating it, I did this once, but I won't do this page again, but I've learned different things or I was inspired or it's what I needed at the moment. 
to just get back into it. Because after doing an art journaling class and journaling like 30 or more pages in a month, you sometimes sort of lose your steam. So looking at this book, it really inspired me and got me motivated again to do more art journaling pages. And so that is the page I wanted to just do first because I knew I had all these collage papers lying around. So if you're looking for some inspiration with color, I would highly recommend the Insight to Color Passions. Again, it was Tanya Jenny for North Light Books. North Light Books. So check it out either at your local bookstore or online. Well, that's it for today's episode. Be sure to check out our website at www.scraptime.ca. And on our next episode, I'm showing you the Imagine Crafts Doodle Sticks. So please join us. Thanks for watching Scrap Time.